All right, family, and welcome to this, that, and the other. Back to the shoes review playlist collection, uh, uh, whatever you want to call it, series. Um, just going to do another vid for you guys, man. Another review of some AJ ones. Sorry if I start coughing, man. I'm still trying to get over this doggone flu, aka cold that I got from my co-worker's kid. It's a long story. So now I'm actually at the tail end of it. So I'm coughing up all that nasty stuff, all that flame and all that extra jazz. But enough of that. Today I wanted to do a review, kind of continue the series that I kind of started on shoe reviews on new shoes I get, new way shoes that I get, real shoes that I get, shoes that I already had and I'm kind of doing an update or doing a review on or I never did a video on it before, but kind of just giving you a wear and tear of other shoe, how it looks afterwards. A lot of YouTubers, shoe YouTubers kind of do shoes when it just come out. So I'll be doing old stuff, new stuff, things I've worn for a while, et cetera, et cetera, et cetera. Uh, so today, what I got for you guys is some AJ1s. These are the box that they uh, uh, came in, um, which regular AJ1 box. Um, but to give you a little story on these shoes here, I kind of got them a while ago. I would say at least about a year from now. And I think these shoes came out um, in 2018, 2017 or something like that. Um, and they just been in my collection. Now, and I haven't worn them in a while. So I was like, hey, why not I just do a review on it. And actually I threw it on eBay as well. And I sold it. Alright, so I'm actually got the box prepared over there. Uh, to ship the shoes out to the uh, buyer. But I was like, you know what, let me do a video on it before I send it out, kind of show you how the shoes kind of held up. Uh, but let me give you guys a little bit more information about the shoes itself. All right, to give you guys a little bit more detail on the shoe, um, so I got my iPad here and kind of pull up some information. Um, so these are called Air Jordan 1 Mid Nouveau. Um, and the colorway of this one's called Space Gray. If I'm not mistaken, it kind of came out, I think, like five different colors. Um, and this one's a Space uh, Gray. Um, I'm saying Space Gray, Space Blue um, colorway, um, which is good to kind of give you that little futuristic um, outer space kind of look, that Space Jam, if you will. Um, if, this colorway kind of reminds me of the Jordan 1's um, All Star um, that they came out with a couple years ago. Um, this color actually reminds me of that. So these shoes actually came out, and I'm not kind of said 2018, 20, um, uh, 17 or something like that. These shoes came out in 2014. Um, I didn't know I had these um, that long. Um, and they held up very, 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 very well. Um, as you can see, the leather quality of these shoes are extremely, extremely good. So once I do the actual close-up of these shoes, you'll be able to see that. It's very soft, very plush. Um, it's easy for it to get scratched up or whatnot. So let's say you scratch it gets a um, rigged or rugged um, surface. It can scratch up the leather. Um, but it's in really, 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 really great good condition. Um, other than that, um, that is a little bitty um, description that I'm going to uh, give on these shoes. Um, you guys could Google um, go on different other channels that did reviews on this way back then to get more in depth. Quote unquote, detail, detail, um, on the description, stuff like that. Uh, but just looking at this uh, right here, and that's what basically uh, what it is. All right, so let's just move on to the close up of the shoe. I'll kind of talk about that, and, um, and then from there we'll close the video. These are the other pairs um, that I have um, that I will be doing a review on soon. All right, you guys, here are we at the close-up um, part of the uh, video uh, for you guys to be able to see the in-depth, close and personal um, uh, aspects of the shoe. Um, as you can see, um, it comes with a white uh, midsole and with the gum bottle, the gum bottom that everybody likes. 
and you can see man like there's not that much wear and tear um on the actual shoe um because i've only worded you know i mean a couple times not that many because you can't really find that much stuff to wear with it but every time i did wear it man everybody really gave me um a lot of um good compliments shoot i need to cut my nails bro dang but um, everybody gave me a lot of good compliments of on it. And if I'm not mistaken, these shoes kind of sat um, when they first originally came out. But once they were all sold out, people kind of start picking them up and buying them um, again. Um, you see the laces right here um, are really um, the nice um, type of uh, uh, laces. Um, Kind of could see the detail they held up pretty well on the inside it has this like suede um type of material which feel good um on the ankles and here it has the uh dates in there and the number um um that it was um on there for it um it has the on the tongue it has that thin uh leather um, where you can see the inside of the letter. It has the anti-gravity machine since 1985. It has the jump man. And it has the, uh, on a background, if I'm not mistaken, this is supposed to represent Chicago, downtown uh, Chicago, or New York. One or the other. Y'all could do y'all research on that. Um, it has the, um, I guess the opposite of embossed um, of the logo. It kind of pops out. Um, very good, very great quality shoes man the leather on the shoes is premier man it's really really very very soft man that's to a point where it's like too soft because it's gonna get damaged easily um now here's the um other one and kind of go over it nice and slow um let me uh take uh this out because I kind of stuffed in um, so I could give it to the seller so I can not. So the inside you'll see your regular jump, man. Um, this runs true to size for a fact. I usually wear, um, for me, I think Jordans kind of run half a size big. But um, I guess it depends on how wide your feet is. Um, so I usually get nine and a half in Jordan ones. Um, and I can still rock a 10 because my natural size is a size 10. But these, man, the nine and a halves are really tight. I'm not even going front, especially on the sides right here. They're tight. They're narrow. Um, so I had to, um, uh, especially if I wanted to get this again, I would have to get the, the 10. Um, and like I said, if you could see the little scuff right there, um, and that's how you could tell um, how um, fragile the uh, leather is. So I'm going to just go through just a little one more um, kind of scoop around the shoes. Um, for you to see and you can see how it just glistens man like it's you really see that space blue um of the shoes very 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 nice um shoe man and i actually had the other one of the other pairs that i'm actually going to keep in my collection which i'll do review on uh later on that so man tell me how y'all think what y'all think um, of these shoes, man. These are um, real, really good pickup. I think at the time I got them, I got them for less than fifty dollars um, when I did get them, and I sold them for a little bit more actually. Um, so yeah, man. So tell me what y'all feel, how y'all like. All right, so that's it for the video today. Um, I want to thank everybody for jumping on and looking at the next video on this series that I'm doing with all my uh, shoes. Um, so tell me what y'all think about the AJ, man, the AJ1s, man, uh, the Nouveau Mids. Um, I know a lot of people don't like mids out there, but the mids are making a comeback. I don't know what the big beef about mids are. I think they all look good as well, especially the certain colorways you can't get. Um, but one thing I want y'all to do, enough about that, like, comment, and subscribe, like, comment, and subscribe, um, look into my playlist, which is my shoe uh, collection, shoe review playlist that I have in my channel, because my channel does consist of other content as well, um, but in this playlist, it has all my shoe stuff, so tell me what y'all think, things you think I should do differently, things you like, you dislike, hate, whatever it is, man, but hope you guys have a great rest of your day to wait for the next video look at my other playlist um god bless and see y'all soon man oh oh